Ladies and gentlemen, welcome again to this uh, space. And uh, right now we are standing. It's very early in the morning. It's around six, uh, close to seven a.m. And uh, as you can see, me, we are right outside uh, one of the beautiful buildings here in Compass, the Sidman Building. And we are right heading to Chicago. Chicago is in Illinois. So Chicago is in Illinois, and that's where we are going today. It's like um, it's like just an like an expo for entrepreneur students, and uh, we're just going there to see how be people are doing business. But now we have to check in, go take some snacks, and uh, because I love eating, so we get the snacks first. All right, we are done with snacks, and now we hit the road. Three. Um, hours will be on the road uh, heading to Chicago and you can see this how it is and um, the good thing about here the roads are very well made and I love it because uh, there's no traffic highway all the way from Grand Rapids to uh, Chicago and but we'll have a stop at um, Indiana which is like a border to Illinois and Grand all right so guys, now this is our first stop here at Indiana. Indiana actually is the border of Illinois State and Michigan State. And we had uh, like a stop here for a, a stopover for like 20 minutes here just to, um, to to stretch up. And then you can see we are in this gas station. And it's, it's a subway where we people, our students went there and uh, took some coffee, some, some do, uh, donuts and yeah, just to easing up as we head to Chicago and I have a couple of friends here with me. We are inside Illinois state now. We just left uh, Michigan and these are steel mill industries. And you can see they produce a lot of steel here and um, the one is that is used for construction, railways and um, yeah, such kind of things. It's a big thing here. almost sleeping but the breeze from lake michigan woke me up and now you can see it is so beautiful here we are heading now to the heart of chicago inside the city Now we are already in uh, Starbucks. This is now inside Chicago and this was our first stop. The most interesting thing here is like they just um, roast coffee, coffee from all parts of the world. That especially I was so interested in this place because I just realized that coffee from Africa, from Tanzania, from Kenya, from Ethiopia, Rwanda, Uganda dominates this market and has been, you can see now these are already processed uh, uh, this is coffee that is about to be uh, fully processed and now people come here in so many numbers just to take coffee they also produce some uh, they make some muffins here and um, yeah all kind of breads here people come here and you just say i want to uh, coffee maybe from tanzania maybe coffee from kenya maybe from uh, brazil and then you get it here it's it's so it's so nice to be here as you can see here, a lot of people are coming here in uh, in numbers, coming in, going out, and everyone here is interested in just taking coffee. The good thing about this place is that you just come and say, I want to drink coffee from Ethiopia or coffee from Puerto Rico or coffee from Brazil, and you're served. And you can see this machine, uh, this is now the, the, the machine that is 
doing all that the automate it is already automated and it's 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 crazy here technology has been used to make sure that the processing of this coffee is done to make sure that you get the final fine product here and i believe that's why people are flocking in uh, flocking in here sorry uh, in so many numbers and you can see the building is so beautiful just this is just a section this in the in the in the third floor which is actually the the last floor and um, everyone is coming to see this 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 beautiful thing how i wish that maybe uh, african countries can have something like this like they we produce a lot of coffee but now it's already important here people are earning a lot of money here you can see so many people they are down they're just coming here to take coffee only and this is something that i don't think americans here produce they just import and then process and you can see it it's I, it was just a, a learning experience for me and i just learned so many things and i loved it because I, I just see how technology is transforming things. So in this section, this is where now the, the coffee is loaded here. You can see this machine is called um, uh, the roast uh, the roaster or it's actually the, the roastery section. So coffee is loaded in this machine and you can see all those pipes over there, the people operating there. So those sections, the, the, the four uh, like barrels there, they contain coffee from different countries. So maybe from Ethiopia, from Kenya, and then maybe based on the orders that they're supposed to make, maybe they have like, you can see the coffee here, they're now loading it. Then it will come to this um, machine here that is covered with the glass um, here, and then they will try like, they, they're trying to sieve. Now, after the processing now, I was so interested in this section. You can see Ugandan, Tanzanian, Kenyan, Ethiopia, Colombia, like African coffee is dominating here, Rwanda, and all these are countries that are producing coffee and they're making Starbucks to survive. And now let's go to the center of Chicago and see what Chicago has for us. So please see you in the next video. Don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell.